Good morning, friends. Welcome to Sudani Food and Lifestyle channel. Today I'm going to be washing my fruits that I brought. I'm going to wash them in some bacon soda and some white vinegar because, you know, I don't like to eat dirty fruits. And I mean, I don't feel like just warm water alone gets all the germs off, so that's why I do that. Okay, especially the strawberry and the blueberry. I'm going to um, wash those in it, okay? Alrighty, come along. Okay, guys, so first I'm going to do my blackberries, okay? Um, so I'm just going to put some, let me just do this. Put some white vinegar in here. Just a little bit. And then I'm going to put some water in there. I'm going to wash it through the strainer because it breaks up easily. And I'm just going to drop them in here. Okay. I'm just going to put a small amount, like a teaspoon of baking soda over it. If there's any flies or germs left in it, it kills it. You see how it froths up? Like that. Just shake it around. And the water. Okay. Because the skin is soft, it breaks up easily, so I'll just shake them off in here. And then I'm gonna wash it off over here in a little warm water with the tea. Okay. Give it a good wash. Put the rinse over here. Give it a good rinse. So they could dry and look at the original water that I washed it in. You see the residue that came off of that? That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Now my pineapples, they're already um, nicely cut up from the store, but I'm still washing them. You know, I mean you don't really have to do those in um baking soda. But I'm definitely going to put a little vinegar in my water and throw them in here. And that's my cut up pineapples already cut up. But I still want to wash them because human hands handle these before they package it, okay? So I'll just put those into that vinegar and water and just wash it nicely. it off properly over here you see even though it's already cored and um, clean according to the supermarket it still has residues on it so it's good to wash them okay Okay guys, last but not least, I'm going to do my lovely strawberries. And my strawberries are organic. That's the one thing I like to buy organic. See here, Drisco organic, okay? And the blackberries, they're organic also, okay? Mm. Pineapple is pineapple because that's peeled, but these are not. They don't have skin where you can peel. So I'm just going to put... Put two of these in there. And I'm going to fill it with a little warm water. Vinegar. And then I'm just going to slightly just take the 
leaves out of, out of them and drop them in there. Okay. This one is spoiled. Sometimes you'll get a bunch of strawberries and you'll find one or two that are already spoiling. So I'll just throw that outside so the birds and the uh, uh, squirrels, they can eat those. <laughs> so, so good. that one doesn't look good either. So. Okay, so now I have all of that here, and I'm just going to throw like a tablespoon of um, baking soda on top of that, okay, so if it has any little animals on the skin, see, squish it around. These won't break up as easily as the, um, the blueberries because the blueberries are softer. These are a little bit harder, so you can rub these with your fingers, okay? And then I'm just gonna wash them off with some nice warm water here. And look at this, you see how dirty this water is? That's what I'm talking about, very dirty. Yeah, look at the residue. See the residue that's down there? You can't see it with your naked eyes, but it's there. Okay. Wash these off. Okay. Put them over here with my pineapple. Okay. And washing them. Put them over there. So nice and colorful right your blackberries your strawberries and my pineapple okay guys so that's how i um wash my fruits when i get them okay guys hope you enjoyed this video please like share and subscribe bye